Today, let's learn about how humans interact with computers. That is nothing but the software. Software, it is the set of programs that governs the fun functions of the computer. In this unit, we are learning about the various types of softwares, definition of the operating system, description of various operating systems, explain various types of operating systems and describing the comparison of operating systems. Let's see what is a software. Software is the heart of hardware. By using software, every, every user get the required functionality from the very hardware component of the computer. It is the middleman or the interface between the user and the hardware. Without software, hardware is just a skeleton. The most important software component of the computer is the operating system. That's where we connect with the computer. It is the interface between the computer hardware, the user, that is the humans or the users. It manages the entire hardware, memories, input, output devices, the CPU, etc. There are various categories of operating systems. Each category is explained with examples and comparisons with other category of operating systems. Software is essentially categorized on three aspects. One, based on the usage. Two, based on the platform. Three, common applications. Based on usage, software as we know is the set of programs that governs the functioning of the computers. It is divided into two parts, system software and application software. System software controls the internal computer operations. It is again further classified into system management program and developing software. In the system management program, we have operating systems, device drivers and system uh, utilities. In the developing software, we have the programming languages, language translator, li linker and loader. Whereas in the application software that carries out the necessary operations for a specified application to the function. It is further classified into general purpose software and specific purpose software. In the general purpose software, we have the word processor, the presentations, the spreadsheets and the image editors. In the specific purpose softwares, we have the uh, reservation systems, uh, we have the report cards, we have uh, report card generation, alternative systems, etc. Based on the platform, a platform refers to the hardware on which the operating system and other softwares run. Based on the platforms, it is for classified into three parts. One is the desktop applications, mobile applications, and web-based applications. In the desktop applications, they run on the desktop operating systems like Macs, Windows, Linux, Unix, etc. Whereas in the mobile applications, which run on mobile operating systems such as Android, iOS, Blackberry, etc. Web-based applications, they run on the browsers such as cloud-based or standalone applications. Common types of software applications that can be categorized into four types. One, productivity software. We, let's see how that can be classified into application type, purpose and examples. In the application type, we have word processing. The purpose of word processing is to create business and personal documents such as letters, reports, memos and manuscripts. The examples are Microsoft Word, then LibreOffice writer that is Linux and Google Docs. Spreadsheet softwares. It creates the worksheets that perform calculations on the financial and statistical data. The examples are Microsoft Excel which uses the numbers Linux and Google Sheets. Email software. To send the messages and receive the emails, manage and address book of contacts etc. Microsoft Outlook, Gmail, Evolution, Linux, etc. Basic da database software. Store and manage the structured data such as lists of contacts, products, and transactions. Microsoft Excel, File Manage, FileMaker, and Li Linux are the examples of data basic database software. Then we have PDF viewers or creators. 
view and create formatted pages for printing or distribution of any platform. Adobe Acrobat and Adobe Reader are the examples of PDF viewers or creators. Presentation software. Create graphical slides to support presentations. Microsoft PowerPoint, Keynote, Linux and Google Slides are the examples of presentation softwares. Desktop publication softwares. We have combined uh, text and graphics into the page layout such as magazine pages or browsers. The examples for desktop publication soft publishing softwares are Microsoft Publisher, Quark, Express, a Mac OS and Windows. Personal Information Manager, we call it as PIS. Manage contacts, leader uh, uh, calendars, tasks, notes and reminders may also send, send and receive messages and manage emails. Microsoft Outlook and Linux are the examples of PIM. Remote desktop software. Access the desktop of one computer from another computer. Windows Remote Desktop. Then the application type, collaborative softwares to talk about. The applications are online workspace. The purpose of online workspace is to provide an online environment for running cloud-based services and applications. The examples are Office Online, Microsoft SharePoint and the Google Docs. Uh, document storage sharing. The purpose of this is provide private or shareable file storage via cloud-based services. Examples are Microsoft OneDrive and Google Drive. Screen sharing software. Enable the remote user to see and take control of another user's screen while the original user and others watch. Example like Zoom, what we have already used for online classes. Windows Remote Assistance can also build into video conferencing softwares. Video conferencing software, the place and receive video calls among two or more locations may also include screen, file and application sharing. For this, we have critics go to meeting. Instant messaging software. The purpose is Enable two or more people to communicate in real time using text may also include video conferencing capability. Examples Yahoo Messenger, Messenger, AOL Instant Messenger, and e email software sends and receives email messages. Example Microsoft Outlook. These all come under the collaborative software. Then we let's move on to utility software. The applications of utility software are anti-malware, it scans the system for a malicious software or malware software including viruses, worms exploit, and exploits uh, viruses. Not on inter internet security, systematic endpoint protection, McAfee virus scan etc. Software firewalls prevent hacks from gaining access to computer remotely via network or internet. Windows firewall and Notron firewall. Diagnostic maintenance software. The purpose of this is check hand hard disks for errors and optimize their performance. Examples are check disk, error checking optimized drivers etc. Compensation of compression softwares. Combine and compress multiple files into single active file that can be more easily distributed. Example, WinZip, compression features built into some operating systems. We have special software, the last concept. In that, the applications are computer-aided design, CAD programming we call, create blueprints and 3D uh, rendering of buildings and the products. AutoCAD is the example for this. Graphic design, create and edit drawings and other artwork, uh, edit photos. Adobe Photoshop and Photoshop Il Adobe Illustrator are the examples of graphic designs. Then medical, one type provides performance information for medical professionals. Another type manages the medical practice, including patients data, scheduling and medical records. 
So in the medical, we have two categories of medical softwares. Then examples are MedClarity, Cairo and Accountable. Scientific applications are one type provides the reference information uh, and tools for scientific professionals and another type manages the process of doing scientific research. We have mathematics, MATLAB and origin as the examples. Financial track and manage the financial information. Many different types exist from the personal finance application to software that runs large accounting departments. Examples TurboTax then QuickBooks. Gaming entertain and potentially educate the user may run on separate PCs in or independently or on a network may be on the desktop, mobile or web based. Examples Candy Crush or uh, World of Wildcraft. Entertainment, we have immense number of uh, purposes for that. Entertain in a specific uh, audience such as playing music or movies or providing digital copies of the magazines to read. Texture, Spoofy, iTunes, Windows Media Player are the examples of entertainment category. Let's move on to the operating systems and understand the features of operating systems. Operating system is the system software that acts as an interface between the user and the hardware. Operating system is placed in the hard disk. When computer is switched on, the bootstrap program loads the operating system into the RAM. Various features or functions of the operating system are booting the computer, command interpretation, input output management, file management, storage management, process management, CPU scheduling, security management, managing network and browsing, the internet and accessing multimedia online and offline. We have the functions of operating system. It does the security device management, file management, memory management, process management, job accounting, secondary storage management, process management, networking and coordination between the software and other users. Let's see what are the types of operating systems. They are categorized into 12 types. First one, the batch processing operating system. The programmer prepares the job or perform on offline devices such as punch cards, submit to the computer operator for later processing. The operator sorts the jobs with similar features as a group or batch and submits it to the operating system. The operating system schedules the CPU for execution. These are outdated operating systems. Example for batch processing operating systems which were used very long back are IBM ZOS. The limitations of this was lot of human interaction, role of OS is very less and the CPU is often idle because the speed of the mechanical input output devices is slower than the CPU. Then single user task operating system. This operating system loads only one task of a single user at a time. Therefore, CPU can only execute one task at a time. Example, DOS, Palm OS, Windows 95, Mac OS. The limitations of this software are lack of execution of multiple tasks, CPU will be idle until another task is ready, more than one user at a time cannot interact with the operating system. Single user multitasking operating system. Only one user at a time will access the operating system. This operating system can load multiple programs, documents of the single user at a time. For example, printer will be printing one task of the document. Then the document of the user can be using another document to program. Even though the computer contains only one processor, the operating system can perform more than one task at a time. For example, the user can listen to music while browsing on the internet and typing a leave letter. Examples of this single user multitasking operating systems are Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 2000, Linux, etc. Limitations, lack of interaction of more than one user at a time, 
there will be slower response from the processor as one processor does many things. Multi-user, multitasking operating systems. More than one user can interact with the operating system at a time by connecting the terminals to the computer and get it done the multiple tasks simultaneously. For example, Ravi and Lata and Srinivas, all three users simultaneously can listen to music, browse the internet while typing and work on MS Word. Here, the objective is to maximize the utilization of the CPU. Examples, Unix, Windows NT, Windows 7, Windows 10, Linux, etc. Limitations of this are connectivity problem, processor is overloaded and gets delay some task based on the priority. Multiprocessing operating system. Here, the task or tasks runs on two or more microprocessors, that is, a computer contains multiple CPUs. All the processing and their management takes place in a parallel way. Hence, these operating systems are called parallel processing operating systems. Each processor works on different parts of the same task on two or more different tasks. Examples, Unix, Windows 10, Linux, Sun Solaris, IBM mainframe, etc. Limitations, network reliability and connectivity problem, cost of multiple CPU is very high, cannot be used in personal computing. Time sharing operating systems. In time sharing operating systems, multitasking processes time is shared among multiple users simultaneously. This operating system enables more many people located at various terminals to use a particular computer system at the same time by switching CPU between the jobs so frequently and thus creates a feeling that only one user is interacting with the operating system. The objective of this is to minimize the response time of for each user. Limitations, problem of reliability as many users are using at the same time question of security and integrity of users program and data problem of data communicate. Real-time operating system. It is multitasking operating system which enables to execute real-time and time-critical applications. These operating systems give quick and predictable response to the events. These operating systems are well-defined, require fixed time constraints. Examples, Windows CE, operating system 9, and Symbian and Linux OS. Embedded operating systems. Embedding the software in a machine which is compact and extreme efficient is the in the design is called as embedded system. The operating systems designed to be used in embedded systems are known as embedded operating systems. This operating system will be used in appliances like microwaves, washing machines, medical diagnostics equipment, etc. Windows CE, FreeBSD, and 3 Minix Embedded Linux, etc. Mobile operating systems. This operating system runs on the mobile devices such as mobile, smartphones, tabs, which, in, which are integrated with voice, data, and multimedia. Example, Google, Android, Microsoft, uh, Windows Phone, Apple iOS, Blackberry, etc. Networking operating systems. A network operating system is sometimes a standalone operating system or one of the features of multi-user, multi-purpose processing operating systems. It runs on a server and provides a server and provides the server capability to manage the data, users, groups, security, applications, and other networking functions. It allows sharing of files and printers among the multiple computers in a network, typically a local area network, we call it as LAN, a private network or to other networks. Examples, Microsoft Windows Server 2003, Microsoft Windows Server 2008, Unix, Linux, Mac OS, uh, no Novel, Netware, etc. Cloud Operating Systems. This operating system run on the cloud computing environment in which data, applications, services are accessed from the cloud data centers on pay and use basis. 
example Amazon AWS, Microsoft Azure etc. Comparison of operating systems. Let us discuss the evolution and other technical aspects of Windows, Linux, Unix, Mac OS and other similarities and dissimilarities. Microsoft Windows operating system. Windows is the most complex in that each version is from the previous versions. The Windows kernel which is based on the operating system 2 in turn is based on MS-DOS which in turn was a cheap clone of CPM. Windows was multitasking operating system and now it is also multi-user operating system. With almost 90% of the operating system market share, you can't miss Windows. It is in commercial buildings, industrial fa facilities as well as home appliances. Windows having been introduced in 1985 is very mature and complete piece of software. Strength, compatibility, technical support is huge, quality of functions etc. Weaknesses, viruses, you may need to buy the antivirus program, slow, Windows is a little comparatively slow than the other softwares. Macil Macintosh OS. Mac OS is even older than Windows. It is the first ever successful graphical based operating system being released one year before the Microsoft counterpart. Mac OS is the resulting of blending the next step operating system from the next cube with Apple OS. The strengths are viruses if you see Apple Mac Macs get almost no viruses. This is mostly due to the Windows superior market share. Reliability, Macs only run on Apple computers and are thus less prone to hardware and software crashing. The looks, obviously it is wonderful. The most of the time Mac just looks better than the Windows. Weaknesses, it is expensive and compatibility is comparatively very low compared to Windows. Linux operating system, Linux and Mac OS are Unix type of operating systems. They are so similar that it can be hard to draw distinctions between them. Today Linux is fully open source Unix system with many flavors that, are, that all share the same kernel. Unfortunately, it has some disadvantages also with respect to price, variety, etc. The diff so, in this lesson, we have learned about the different types of operating systems like batch processing operating system, single user, single task operating systems, single user, multitasking operating systems, multi user, multitasking operating systems, multi processing operating systems, time sharing operating systems, real time operating systems, embedded operating systems, distributed operating systems, mobile operating systems, network operating systems, and cloud computing operating operating systems. Thank you very much.